With this bad couple of freezes we had, right up there, we have a banana balloon coming out. Can't quite see it, but it's, let's see, I think it's right there in the center. That's uh, one of our ice cream banana ones. And as you could tell, all the bananas are coming back to life. Um, I've lost these plants here. Don't think they're coming back. We got a lot going on over here. Mr. and Mrs. Turkey are doing great. And we are now starting to get eggs from Mrs. Turkey. She is our royal palm. He is our red bourbon. These are their babies. They're all girls. Hi, Mrs. Turkey. Hi, Mr. Turkey. Hi. And then here's Stupid and his girls. You guys going to bed for the night? Yeah. They've been out all day. They were the ones that made the mess underneath my car. Bonnie, Clyde. Hi, guys. How's Bonnie? What's Bonnie doing? Hi, Clyde. But I wanted to show you, we were able to get the babies in the new pen. Hi, Clyde boy. How my lover boy. Yes, I see that tail wagon. Yes, I know. Clyde, once he's out, he likes to headbutt your back of your knees. Yes, he does. Hi, bunny girl. How my bunny girl. How's bunny doing? She's come such a long way. She used to be so scared of being touched. And now she gets all the attention. Yes, she does. All right, so we're going to go in. This is our grow out pen. This is originally last season. You guys saw it as in we had all the turkeys in here. Well, now we put up a small divider. We chicken wired the entire area, even on the side we're not using. And we have all the baby chicks, our meat birds, in here. What are you guys doing? Hi. Hi, babies. Yep, they're doing good. We got plenty of water out here for them. Um, inside is their feeder and the heating lamp which we turn off during the day. We turn it on just before the sun goes down. They've only been out here a few hours and they are just absolutely loving it. They are just, they're not crowded anymore. They're able to scratch and peck. And inside here, I'm going to tuck you guys in. Got hay in the food. Hey guys. Huh. Um, so far, out of the 50, I think we're down to 40. We, um, when we took them out of the house to the outside brooder, which is just outside our house, we lost a few. They did not transition well. That's another story, no, something else we're going to be going through because uh, we're going to be doing a lot of changes with our food system here. Um, we've dialed it, we're dialing things in. You know, we've only been doing this, you know, less than five years. And three of those years, you guys, this is year three on for our YouTube channel. Oh my goodness, Clyde. Their head button to the fence. <clears throat> what are you doing? <laughs> so, these guys, this is going to be their first night out here. 
so everything should be good on that and like i said it's just a a barrier that tree limb that fell we're using that to hold down the fencing so nobody can get in clyde what are you doing clyde what are you doing clyde boy what you doing well, you gotta hold still I can't move my camera that fast. <laughs> Hi, baby boy. Yeah, I'm trying to close the gate and lock it. Or fancy locking system. <laughs> Bungee cords. What cry boy? What cry boy? Yeah. I know. I know. I know. Yes. Bunny girl. I'm going to go bye-bye. What are you eating? What are you doing, Clyde? <laughs> Hi, Bunny. What's your boyfriend doing, huh? What's your boyfriend doing? Yeah. What you doing, Clyde? <laughs> you okay? <laughs> Are you okay, Clyde? Ma. What you doing, bunny girl? You need to finish your food. You haven't eaten all your dinner yet. What you doing, Clyde? Ma. Ma. I can see it. Here it, comes. Here it comes. You're wound up like a cat, Clyde. Meh. <laughs> oh, you're so funny. All right. Good night, bunny girl. You get sweet dreams? Yes. You like to scratch? Yes. Your cute little horns. I can't wait because here soon Bonnie turns a year old Clyde is three months younger so here soon Donald's gonna have to build a little shed barn because he, we want to breed Bonnie and Clyde and I told him in order to do that I need more than an igloo only because if Bonnie gives birth, I'm not crawling inside of an igloo. A bunny girl. Huh. Is that right? Is that what we told Daddy? Your brother's acting silly. Not your brother, your boyfriend. Your buddy's acting silly. What are you doing, Clyde? <laughs> this is the prickly pear cactus I got new growth on it alrighty we got it mowed we got trees taken out we got everything set up we need to call it a day we got to do some more planting we're gonna be putting down the black uh, landscaping tarp here we're gonna be planting bushes here the meringue over there and some sunflowers so it's coming along um, it's just taking us a lot longer than we thought it would because it was um, a couple different problems we ran into the strawberry tree when we pulled it up the um, we had to cut a lot of huge roots and we made the decision to just go ahead and start over with the ones we have, their babies, so it'll take another year for us to get fruit, but we're okay with that. Luna got a haircut, homemade haircut. 
We'll probably cut her again and, and tweak it later tonight. We gotta trim their claws. So, and then there's our hoopy. And um, pretty much we're getting there. The mound is still a disaster. That's the next thing. So we'll work on that. One thing at a time. Hi, honey. <laughs> Come on, Luna. Inside the house. All righty, it's that time of year. Got to check out the sprinkler system. Make sure we're ready to go. Donald is uh, going around checking for leaks, for things that don't work, barely work, changing out the heads. Woo! Get wet now. Do you increase the pressure? So, let me walk down this way. We have um, three zones. This is zone one. And this runs from the well pump all the way to our uh, front gate area. And we are checking for leaks, checking for just uh, sprinkler heads that aren't working or ones that we need to change the direction because we bought some extra heads so we can see what's going on. So we're going to go ahead and get that done now. Oh, look, I got a broken head. What's wrong, Miss Turkey? You all fluffed up. All right, we're guys, we're gonna put on zone two now. This is along the front of the house. Starting. Do you wanna take this one and turn it off? Oh, we got a big spring leak. All right, Donald's gonna plug that. But this one will take care of a lot of our plants. We're gonna be trimming up the uh, banana limbs here soon. Ooh, that one's squirting way over here. Holy cow. This is our herb garden. Ooh, let me get by and get wet. And then it also runs along the house here for all of these bananas and all the way to the low quat here and this little patch gets watered so some of these we'll be able to take out like we took out we probably don't need that one there we'll just turn that head off for right now eventually we will be planting there so we're going to go ahead and Run our eyeballs down and check it out. Okay, and then this is also zone two. We had forgotten about it. It's been so long. This is on the side of our shed. Feeds the uh, bananas. All these are doing good. So Donald has to fix the uh, the squirter over there, the fountain of youth. Um, he doesn't have it. It's inside the house. So we'll fix that probably in a few moments. But all this is good. And then this is our zone three. This is food forest number two. Um, we have it all into here, along the back of the fence, in the middle of everything here. So Donald's gonna turn that on and hopefully, because actually I think the hose mechanism's under that bucket. I don't think it works. Cause we, it, got brittle so we'll see what we can do all right here we go
All right, I see a leak right there. It's squirting straight up. All right. We're gonna go ahead and get this all settled in. And then we are gonna call it a night. Go inside, have us some dinner. Clyde, what are you doing? <laughs> Hi, bunny girl. Clyde. Go ahead and comment below if you've been working hard in your garden and what you guys are planning on planting. And then we will see you on the next one. Bye, all.